Hey guys, I'm gonna show you a shopping guide for weekly trips to the grocery store, as well as recipes and meal preps. My boyfriend and I do our shopping on Trader Joe's. They have very cheap prices and very delicious options. The total was $140, however, some of the stuff we got lasts longer than a week, like oatmeal, rice, almonds, ham, and some other stuff, so we usually spend way less when we restock every Sunday. Also, some of the items we bought are not completely necessary, we just splurge a little with some of them to make awesome meals to show you guys. Starting off Monday with a big bottle of water and some warm water with lime juice. Trying out the winter blend coffee with our French press that I got from Amazon, link in the description below. For myself, I'm making oatmeal with almond milk, water and cinnamon. For my boyfriend, I'm making some waffles, dressing agave syrup and sunny side eggs. I like to add fresh strawberries, shredded almonds and dark chocolate chips to my oatmeal for a sweeter taste. I like to work out in the mornings between breakfast and lunch. And for these, I prepare peanut butter energy bites made with one cup of raw oats, a quarter cup chocolate chips, two big spoonfuls of creamy peanut butter and about two tablespoons of honey. I mix all of the ingredients together and make small balls with my hands. I usually have an extra bowl with water on the side in case it gets too sticky. Freeze them for an hour and then store them in the fridge. For workout, I follow Chloe Ting's Get Fit Challenge. I basically repeat the cycle after I'm done. And also some cardio, very important. For lunch, I made a tuna salad with bell peppers, tomatoes and arugula for my boyfriend for work. and some chocolate pretzels for a little dessert. For myself, I cook some snow peas and broccoli next to an English muffin with goat cheese, arugula, ham, and a scrambled egg. I had some pretzels for an afternoon snack. And for dinner, I'm cooking rice, grilling some chicken with broccoli, snow peas, bell peppers, and dressing it with a soy marinating sauce. It goes nice over a bed of rice. For his lunch, I put together leftover rice beans, avocado, tomatoes, and some cilantro. For breakfast, I made him scrambled egg and ham sandwich. This water bottle helps you keep track of how much water you're drinking throughout the day. You can find the link below. I got it from Amazon. I made myself an avocado toast with a sunny side egg on top. Getting some energy bites before working out. I made a homemade iced tea with just three bags of any tea of your choosing. This is pomegranate white tea. Dissolve some brown sugar. Finally, I added the juice of two large limes to finish it up. For lunch, I made myself the same thing. Some rice, beans, avocado, tomatoes, and cilantro. For dinner, I cook the gnocchi and shrimp on a pan, seasoned with garlic powder, salt, and paprika. Toss some broccoli and the gnocchi in with the shrimp and added some of the soy marinating sauce. And then some pretzels for dessert. Waffles and sunny side eggs for him. Oatmeal with strawberries, almonds, and chocolate for me. I have a little pre-workout energy bite. For work, I made him a tuna sandwich with avocado, fresh bell peppers, and arugula. 
got him some pretzels for dessert and poured some of the leftover coffee into an iced almond latte. For myself, I made a crunchy tuna salad with arugula, bell peppers, tomatoes, avocado, cilantro, and dressed it with a sesame ginger salad dressing that I found in the fridge, pairing it up with the pita chips for extra crunchiness. I got some iced coffee as well for an afternoon boost. For dinner, I'm making pasta and meatballs. I mix up raw oats, one egg, garlic powder, salt and pepper with the ground beef for extra flavor. I make the meatballs by hand and then cook them with some avocado oil while the pasta is cooking. I added some dried oregano to the pasta and placed the meatballs on top. Added some vodka sauce I also found in the fridge to make it creamier, having some of the mango juice with dinner. I also did some meal prep since Thursday is also an early day. Got his coffee ready, scrambled egg and ham sandwich for breakfast, and rice, beans, chicken, bowl with tomatoes and cilantro for lunch. For my breakfast, I made an English muffin with goat cheese, arugula, and a scrambled egg. Got this new milk frother in the mail, you can also find the link in the description below. More energy bites before working out. For lunch, I had the same rice and beans and some of the pre-made chicken from the night before. Added some tomatoes and cilantro for freshness. Went out to do some Christmas shopping, so we got a coffee. For dinner, I'm making the other half of the gnocchi left. Grilling some chicken and cherry tomatoes and mixing it all up. Added some goat cheese and vodka sauce to make it creamier. And chocolate pretzels for dessert. Can get enough of these. Friday morning, waffles and eggs for him, with some arugula to get some greens in there. And some oatmeal with the usual toppings for myself. Made him another tuna sandwich for lunch and more chocolate pretzels. Made my usual English muffin with goat cheese, arugula, and two scrambled eggs this time for lunch. Also added some beans on the side. Refilling my water bottle and getting a little afternoon snack. For dinner, I'm making a shrimp cocktail. I'm cooking the shrimp with garlic powder and pepper and added a lot of cilantro. Chop some bell peppers, the shrimp as well, and mix it together. Added avocado and lime juice, and finally folded in the cocktail sauce. Some iced tea on the side and some pita chips to dip into the shrimp cocktail. It's finally the weekend and we are both having waffles and eggs for breakfast. DLL workout also got some energy bites. Made grilled chicken sandwiches with barbecue sauce, avocado, and grilled bell peppers. Now this is totally optional as it adds to the expenses, but we were feeling lazy Saturday night, so we ordered in. However, we still had plenty of groceries to have cooked dinner. We love ordering from this place called the Taco Project. I ordered the shrimp tacos, which come fried and lots of good stuff in, and the corn tortilla tastes authentic, that's why I love it so much. We also ordered some fries on the side, and he got a chicken, beans, and rice bowl. It's so good. And to wrap up the week, Sunday morning, I had one waffle on the side, he had three with eggs, and I also had some oatmeal with the usual toppings. For lunch, I made us pasta with bell peppers, tuna, lime juice, pepper, and some honey mustard I also found on the fridge from past grocery shopping. I mix it all up and put it over a bed of arugula.
For dinner, I cook broccoli, snow peas, and bell peppers with chicken. Made some rice on the side and dressed the chicken and veggies with a soyaki sauce. On Sundays is when we go grocery shopping typically, so we restock our kitchen and often try out new stuff like these vanilla mochi and peanut butter and chocolate mochi. I hope you guys enjoyed this video and I'll see you on the next one.